welcome to my tutorials project online today I will show you how to create a project in PHP okay. so before starting a project I need to project I need to uh, download bootstrap file bootstrap file okay and zoom that I zoom that I have a bootstrap file in my computer so I don't need to download and install it okay so first start of all now I just uh, start clamp server okay, yes okay, so this is green okay and after that I need to create a project with my new folder then my project name of I apply with the job online. Okay, job online. And after that, I need to copy copy the, the previous my previous project with the bootstrap file. Go to the generally and choose the I just one terrace I just back up and I, and I copy the project from such a CC center in the CS phone email JS and PHP okay and it and go to my project job online Adobe okay in this folder in this folder in each folder cs folder they have many files and if something there's not a uh, so let's just uh, we delete it okay delete it and in the font it's a font that i use in a project image is a yeah, so simple image and it's is that's an important for me i need to delete it delete Okay, I just uh, image status. Okay, and in my JS, uh, I need to delete the empty file and jQuery dot data I need and then delete it. Okay, I just I just keep it. Okay, and in PHP file is uh, I will delete all this file. Okay, delete. Delete it. Okay. okay. So I first go to my index file. My name is uh, index.php. Yes. Okay. And I starting this folder with the sublime tag. I apply with sublime tag. Okay. Now I close it all together. And then close it. Okay. Catch it. Close it again. Okay and i i put i drag i drag my folder take my project folder to my sublime tag put it here okay this is uh, is folder it will uh, only here so here okay so in my index.php i will write the uh, html and then a uh, job online project uh, job online project and after that I need to go to the browsers and run with my local host and my project name is uh, job online okay and I enter so it is so the title of the website but the title and I just delete it okay and after that and after that I need to write the different new club container Container. So I will uh, start container. In the zoom that, and I have new class row. New, new view. I use class row, and I rename it my header. My header. My 
dashboard oh my dashboard okay my dashboard and uh, the little my header just my my header header okay so I will apply the spy this section and I will use the link the style sheet and I go to the CS the web project CS and then oh I will go to this and write with the name of bootstrap dot CS okay and after that I have one new script and I just SOC the location of the JS and I use JS bootstrap dot JS okay and then something will go here okay I just attach only one input type Python plus btn btn success okay and i will refresh it and uh, what does it happen okay so this is the budong that's in the bootstrap okay i have configure and i also link to my my custom uh, i need to call dashboard.cs okay dashboard.cs and then i just create one file with the name of dashboard.cs okay in the cs i will control to the oh uh, this is uh, title uh, i need uh, one row and delete it Long here. Okay, I will show you in the more video altogether. Okay, see you in this video.